Story Time News this evening. Not trained caregivers. Questions about young men who accompanied children to Jamaica from Haiti. Bombshell update from the police about how journalist Job Nelson died. And yet another pollution incident detected in the Rio Cobre. Good evening and welcome to Primetime News. We're live on air and also online at onespotmedia.com. A very special welcome also to those of you joining us on TVJ International in the Cayman Islands. I am Javon Keyes. And I'm Janella Precious. Also coming up in business news, CIBC is introducing a new digital platform. And remember that rent-to-own policy announced by the government about two years ago? Well, stakeholders want that initiative to be fast-tracked. All of that will be in the business day. Guess what? Spencer Darlington is also standing by with a preview of what's to come in sports. Spencer? Thank you very much, Javon. We're going to be looking at the state of readiness for a reigning world champion heading into this weekend's national trials at the National Stadium. We'll tell you more in primetime sports later. And Romain is also here with a preview of the weather report and forecast. Romain? Thanks, Janela. We are expecting some thunderstorm activity across the island this Friday, but up until we get to Friday, we still have isolated thunderstorms across Western Parishes in the afternoons. Never complaining about rainfall at all. Now, we also have in this newscast sports commentary and E-Prime, but before the break, the feedback question. And this evening, we are asking what steps do you take to ensure your children will be safe when sending them overseas. Share those comments online at facebook.com slash television Jamaica and post on X at TVJ News Center. Please stay with us. Primetime News returns after this break.